We start with Hall of Fame Team 111. Wild Stay! for our Midwest Regional and today we're staying outside of the pits getting ready for our next match. In three, two, one, go! Autonomous picks off here for match number 11. First launches from Wild Sing. So this is a really cool opportunity. It's our second competition this season, which is so exciting. And it's really cool because all these teams have been working hard for the last six weeks and months, preparing since January for this competition. Stuart, everything looks fine. Everything's blinking. We have teams from all over the world. We have a couple teams from India and a team from France, and then all over the Midwest for the Midwest Regional. Um, and it's really cool because we all have our own pits and we're all fixing our robots and working together and competing. Well, we won and I think we got four RPs, but it was a kind of a messy match. Uh, we got 31 balls, so that's good, but... Uh, and then they flipped over trying to crash into us, so that was interesting. So we've been competing all morning and we've had a couple matches so far and our driver Nick has been doing a really great job and Jack, our manipulator, has been doing an awesome job. So in our first two matches, we were able to get the four ranking points for each match and so far we're in third place, hoping to move up to first. All right, so when an, during an actual match, there's two alliances. There's a red alliance and there's a blue alliance. And so our main goal is to shoot as many balls as we can into the top goal, which is eight feet tall and rack up those points throughout the telly off match, which is about two minutes and 15 seconds. And so at the end of the match, in the last 30 seconds, all the robots go to their hangers to climb, and if you make it to the very top traversal rung, then you get 15 points. So going into our final match, it really came down that we had to be exactly perfect. So starting off the match, we had initially more points than the other alliance, and then getting into the big chunk of the actual match, we were trailing behind them by a few points, and then it was tied. They get more than us, and then it's tied again. So at the end of the match, after the robots climbed, it seemed like we were pretty neck and neck, but the final score hadn't officially come out yet. So that waiting with us and the drive team and all the other drive teams felt like a very long time. It, you know, the graphic came up and it said that the red alliance won. We all just went crazy. <laughs> It was an amazing feeling. We won at our last competition, but it feels so good to win again. And each time it's like, oh my God, we did it. And so it was really great. All the hours in the shop, designing the robot, fixing things, the time that we spent in the pits, the pit crew did an amazing job. Everything, it just, it felt like the whole, we did it. Like we finally made it, we're moving on. No, it was a really good feeling. <laughs> 